In this video, I'll be ranking streamer setups. Before the video, I want to point out my Himalayan salt lamp I got here. I got some flack for it, having a rock plugged into the wall. It's a Himalayan salt lamp, people. Don't go give me a hard time. Now what's just inspiring this video is I want to revamp my setup and kind of the background. Because obviously you can see my... I got a suitcase laying there, I got a table full of cards, my bed, I, I, need, I need to revamp my setup, so I need some inspiration. We're starting off with PewDiePie. Yeah, take it in. I've always liked PewDiePie's aesthetic. It's always clean, neat, mim minimalist. Dexterity intelligence. I know it's a bit odd to have the gym in here, but I like it. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I kind of got a little mini gym. I got yoga mat and a medicine ball. I don't know if you guys have seen PewDiePie without a shirt on, but he has gotten swole. It's coming up right here. Look at this. He, he, look how jacked he is. He is yoked. He's huge. So that, that home gym is really paying off. Yeah, he's he's getting big. He's 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 jacked. Back to back to his setup. I I respect that he's got the the squat squat rack. Personally, I'd go with a with a bench because you know. I, I, I like skip leg day. Even just being able to do football or something, I don't know. I would 100% break, put a hole in the wall. <laughs> That's very cool. It's so much more fun. There's so much. Right, I want to see more, more of a setup now. here instead of just this gym. Put together, basically. It's not supposed to be an L-shaped desk, but I made it into it, which worked out great. I'm super happy. I have an L-shaped desk. Finally. I like the bookshelf. Same My bookshelf's in the living room. Dog bed. Curve monitor, the vertical monitor. I'm not so, I'm not so into building Gundams, but it, it does have a nice aesthetic. That's what I have on this side. I got a vertical monitor, and then on this side I got a horizontal monitor, but it's actually facing my bed. I'm using it as a TV. Alright, I think I've seen enough of PewDiePie's. What was that? I don't know. Um, PewDiePie, it's very minimalist. Um, the aesthetic's nice. Not enough LEDs, you know? You gotta, you gotta have some LEDs in your setup. But uh, the home gym boosted up for me, so I'm gonna give it an A. Alright, next up, we got Marquise Brownlee. Now, I don't watch him as much as I watch PewDiePie, but obviously most of you guys should know who this guy is. Right off the bat, it is a standing desk. So the desk very clean. Extremely clean. Custom sized X desk, but an S X desk Air Pro, right? So I'm not thin sheet of super into the uh, standing desks. That have motors in each of them, and the thing about oh, you can okay, it can go down though. Like always bring up is it's sure there's, can. There's a bunch of uh, power. All the things that are on the desk. I'm not gonna lie, I was expecting a lot better. Cable management for Marquise Brownlee since he's such a try to plug in a tech guy. Right here, so that's one. I've been using those, um, but other stuff like I have. A it's a mouse pad. He spent a lot of time talking about that mouse pad. These are the studio monitors, Yamaha HS8s. This might be the longest running thing in the setup right now. Uh, eight inch woofer, one inch tweeter. Second, but if you ask Andrew or somebody else, like they're just backups. So a lot of people like some raw footage, but really his lights. So this is more like his his office desk and like his setup. If I didn't have the nano texture. All right, I've, I've seen enough. Um, honestly, it's it's a little too plain for me, and I was expecting way more things from from Marquis. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it C. All right, next up we got Pokemon. I wonder why it's blurred out. So it's probably she got a new setup now. She's got that kawaii aesthetic. Pretty pretty standard for a lot of a lot of gamer girls out there. The newest additions to my setup are just these I see the, the cable management is not the best. I can see it down there. Actually, I guess I can start going to full screen. I don't know. I apologize. I should went full screen in the beginning. I just just now thought about that. 
and I'm, and I'm not going to re-record. Chances are you made it. To be honest. That's true. That's pretty true. That's pretty true. I mean, oh, train wrecks. That's true. And then I have that that doesn't uh, that doesn't age well. Keyboard, Got the DLXR. Don't have my mouse showing right now because I'm using a top secret unknown email. That's why it's blurred out. Probably just a sponsored mouse. This is like my favorite piece of art that we've ever commissioned or ever done. I love my Astro A40s, but I need to get these replaced and I, they, they're starting to cut out. I've had these for like five or six years now. And, or they, I can't remember if they're Astro A40s or A50s, honestly. Astro A50s, Astro A50s, and I've had these for like four or five years. And I need to, I need to, I need to upgrade soon. The cable management is stressing me out. That is horrible cable management. Really oh my goodness. So that's what the box is for. Good posture though. My posture is horrible. And I'm always leaning forward. It is a great looking PC. I love the RAM. The RAM looks really cool. The backup, we got the PS5. That's cool. That's probably expensive. It's got to cram it. The, gl the glitch pop knife. Is that the is that the prime? That was really cool. And the switch. Pokemon. She has a pretty nice setup. She's got some cool, cool stuff going on, but her cable management is horrendous. And so it's, got, it'd be an A if it had better cable management, but the cable management puts it down to a B. Now at the beginning of the video, I mentioned that I wanted to use some of these setups as inspiration, but some of them are just unfeasible like this setup. I've seen this video before and this setup is insane. It's so nice. This is like everyone's dream setup. I mean, it really doesn't get much better than this. It's got that Roy's Royce ceiling, which is really cool. It's got some gas setups, his main setup, mini fridge. That's a cool mini fridge too. I really like that. The LED, um, I don't even know, door, and it changes. It's, that's so cool. I would love that fridge for anything other than respawn. Not a big fan of respawn. That's so cool though. I mean, it's just amazing. That waterfall over here on the side, so that's so cool. But I mean, this is millions of dollars. Unfeasible for the average gamer or content creator. Beautiful, though. It's kind of a long video, so that's why I'm skipping through. Yeah, he rocks the Astros as well. He's, he's the reason why I even got Astro A50s back in, back in the day. You got all that really cool soundproofing. I got some soundproofing over there, but it's cheap stuff I got off Amazon. That's some expensive soundproofing. That fireplace, nice TV. Man, this is a great setup overall. And this is his main setup here. And be kind of backed into a corner while still being able to, to view the room and see what's going the Three monitors with the, the, part of the TV. I guess I, that's another monitor up there. Area, but Super wide monitor. To it. Um, this, ceiling this is beautiful. I mean, that's a long video. If you want to check out the full thing, just look up Nick Merck's setup. And it's a, it's a, it's a beautiful, beautiful setup.
And no doubt about it. I mean, obviously, it's an, it's an S-tier setup. No doubt. Next up, we got Ludwig. This is a short video, so we just watched the whole thing. I don't even know if he shows the setup. It's just titled Setup Tour. But we're already 30 seconds in in a minute video. Don't you see the background? It's got like an old entrepreneur aesthetic. I guess we're just seeing his back. I mean, you can just go to his streams and see this. We're not seeing actually much of a setup. This is from a year ago. Almost a year ago. Yeah, we're not going to see much of a setup. Um, I was expecting to see a little bit more. I'm just going to put it at C. Let me just see the background. Um, That's a nice background, but at the same time, we don't get to see his, his PC rig and his setup at all. Now, I had this one recommended to me. I never watched I Show Speed. I know he's pretty big. And he's growing fast. I've never watched. I see some clips, but I never actually watched them before. Um, a little dirty. Does he stream just PC on a PlayStation Five? There's no way it's that dirty. Did he do this on purpose? I know he's young and stuff, but I don't even know what the, what is that? Then I got my um, you feel me? I got my mouse right here. I don't know if you, if anybody watches I Show Speed, comment. Let me know if it's like set up and he made it dirty as for like a gag. God, I can't. I can't believe this would be this dirty. Everything's too zoomed in. I can't even tell what 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 stuff is. Makes my uh, makes me feel better about my setup though. You know, oh yeah. Cause everyone else is so much better than mine. Definitely funny guy. People aren't watching him for his setup. They're watching him for his comedy. All right, all right. I think this one's obvious. I think it's super clean. S tier. I'm just kidding. No, it's just way too dirty for me. It's a D tier setup, but it makes me feel better about mine. Like I said, if if anybody watches him, let me know if I was like, if that's a gag or not. Like, is it actually that dirty, or he he did that on purpose? All right, and last but not least, we're gonna check out Jack Septicai's setup. Super clean. This is kind of something I want. I want a isolated room. But that's gonna have great sound control with all the the soundproofing. I do my streams. Game is usually here. Um, my camera's back here. I have this. I feel like it make it easier to focus in just like an isolated small room like this. Focus. So the HDMI from this one. That's what I want to do soon. I want to do a two PC setup so really soon. This computer breaks while playing games. Then the second PC is still up and running, and the stream still goes. Check out his background if they showed it at all. Um, but his background's gonna blurt out. You don't peek. But overall, I mean, it's a clean setup. Very clean. Kind of bland, though. Kind of a little bit boring. And so for Jack Septicai, I'll, I'll put it with Pokey at B. So this is my stream rankings. I obviously only did a couple because they're pretty long videos. But if there's any cool setups that you know of, comment below. I'll check them out. And I want to add more streamers or YouTubers to this, uh, this tier list. But overall, that's going to do it for this video. There might be a part two. I'm not really sure. But please like and subscribe, especially subscribe. I'm getting really close to a thousand, so it'd be really, really awesome if I get there. But I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.